feeling so small Watch the clock ticking off the wall Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to today's video. As you can see from the title of today's video, today's video is an everything five pound haul. Haven't done one of these in ages. Obviously January was a no spend January. So I did order these things in February. I think I spent about 50 pound altogether. Um, one of the items they ended up emailing me and telling me that wasn't in stock, which I was kind of gutted because it was a really nice item. But obviously with everything five pound, everything goes out of stock so, so quick. So you need to be, you need to be rapid with it so you do have to troll the pages I've got to say and I always say this in my video but please sign up for the newsletter because they do feature some of the good stuff in the newsletter and then you can put your order in straight away so without further ado um, if this is the type of video you like don't forget to give me that big thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more of this kind of content so let's get into the video first off I actually wore this yesterday um, normally I wash them before normally everything from everything five pounds sometimes smells a little bit musty I've got to say but this one smells fine so I actually wore it yesterday you may have seen it in my vlog video if that's gone up now already or not I'm not sure um because I'm not sure when they're gonna go up but this is lovely it comes in loads of different colors sorry for the crackling um but it is this beautiful jumper with this sort of like fringed section on the sleeve it is about to you just past your waist it's not too long it's in this lovely sort of black and white they did it in a few different colors as well i thought it was lovely i would like it in another couple of colors but to be fair i don't really need any more clothes um to be honest i need a huge declutter um to get rid of stuff because my wardrobes are jammed they are jammed if that's something that you want to see a massive declutter um i could film that I think I've done a couple in my time on YouTube. I think they did quite well. If you like a decluttering video, leave me a comment below and I'll film that. So that was the first item. Obviously it was £5. Thought it looked amazing. So yeah, brilliant. Um, it was from a brand, sorry, I did keep the label just for this video, called Capsule One. Never heard of them before. Um, so if you have, leave me a comment. But yeah, that's the first item. Just before I move on, just to say I actually got this in a... Uh, I think it was just a standard one size fits all if I'm not correct because it doesn't have a size on it So that was that one then obviously this one everything seemed to come in a packet as well And um, I can't remember what it is. So excuse the rustling right. So this was in a size medium um, As it says there on the little sticker. This is kind of like a roll neck or a thick you know, roll neck jumper It's got some nice sort of pattern detail on the front there which I don't think you can see but it's got a nice sort of stitch going on there it's a good length as well so you could wear it with jeans like skinny jeans you could wear it with leggings uh, it looks like it's going to be slightly longer than the other one so it could just cover your bum basically so you could wear it with leggings as well um but yeah this is just a standard plain jumper but it looks really really nice it feels really good quality um the ticket on there this it says basic style not sure again where that's from looks amazing looks lovely looking forward to wearing it next week right next up again this one's packaged um this was a skirt now i've been after one of these for ages i kind of like the leather look sort of floaty kind of skirt and i did see one uh, I saw one in Marks and Spencer's one time, just before, way before lockdown, and, but I didn't really like it. It looked a little bit old fashioned. And I've seen a couple online that look really good, but obviously on a wave style person, like a wave style model. Um, and I didn't know whether that would suit me either. So I got this one uh, for £5. It was worth it for a fiver. Uh, and it has kind of got like a zebra print on it, but I thought it was really quite nice. So it's got an elasticated waist uh, and it's kind of floaty. Um, it's kind of calf length as well. Now the brand is called Fix A and I got it in an XL. Again, not sure how baggy it is around the waist. It might just sit on my hips, but I don't mind. Um, I don't, didn't want it too tight. I wasn't sure what size to get, but yeah, I got that. Um, and I thought it looked quite nice actually. Um, yeah, and I do, I love that sort of material. It's very kind of like autumn, winter, sort of you can wear it around those sort of times. So that was the next item right next up we have a uh something in black in a size 12 right so this is a swing dress so yeah i remember ordering this actually it is stretchy as well size 12 it's by 
uh, Anis Aniston. I'm um, not sure of that sort of brand label, but it's got little cap sleeves, a uh, swing style skirt. I hope it's not too short. I don't think it will be, but it's just a standard black one. You can put a really nice belt on this just to jazz it up a little bit. Looks very nice. Um, yeah, just nice and plain and you can just cultivate it up with a nice jacket or, um, or a nice belt or whatever. And it could look nice, looks good with tights. Um, and you could sort of wear it in winter, wear it in summer. It's kind of versatile. So yeah, that was that one. Really happy with that actually. It looks really nice. Right, next up we have another package. This was in grey. I got this in a 14 to 16. Now this has Avon on the back. Now I'm an Avon representative. Um, so um, it's a mini skirt. I'm not sure of the sizing. I don't really buy a lot of clothes from Avon. I think they're a little bit on the small size. So I got 14 to 16. So it could be too big, could be just right. I don't know. This looks amazing on the picture actually. I think if I'm not correct, it was like, like an asymmetrical style. Yeah, it does look quite large around the waist. Uh, but you never know, it might just be you know, I might just be thinking that it is, but it is this kind of like floaty, let me just roll back a little bit, floaty kind of skirt, it sort of goes down at the sides and sort of up in the middle, um, for some reason I thought it was asymmetrical, it has got like a tie as well, so you can tie it around your waist, it's been lovely in the summer to be fair, nice and floaty, um, and you might need to wear an underskirt under it because it kind of looks a little bit see-through. I generally wear like a white underskirt under stuff like this because I just don't want like you can see your underwear and stuff like that. It's not that nice, is it? We'll have to give this a little try on. It may be too big. If it's too big, then either charity or I'll see if my sister, see if it fits my sister better. Although she is about more or less the same size as me now, well done Lisa. Um, yeah, she's lost quite a few, she's lost a few stone actually, so she's on, we're, I think we're almost the same size. So yeah, um, that may go to her, it doesn't fit me, but I thought it was really nice. Anyway, I thought I'd give it a go, but as I say, the sizing was a little bit weird. I think it was like 10, 12, 14, 16, so kind of which one do you go for, do you know? So I went for 14, 16, um, just to be on the safe side. So that's that one. Right, next up we have this, um, it's kind of like a houndstooth kind of pattern. I kind of like these sort of funky pattern shapes. Right, so this is by a company called Mode. If I hold it the right way up, um, it has a belt with it and it is some skinny sort of trousers. Now they look tiny, I've got to say, so let's ho hope they're stretchy. They're a little bit stretchy but they are small. They are so small. Um, to be honest, I don't think they're going to fit me. Tiny, they look like a child size. Um, so yeah. <laughs> I'll have to give them a go, but obviously if there's no insert clip to these, that means it didn't fit me, or I'll leave it on the screen. Um, but what size did I get? I got a large, that extra large. This is why you have to be a bit careful on the sizes. That is nowhere large to extra large. And there isn't much give to it, but I'll give it a go, you never know. Um, but yeah, that's those. <laughs> Right, next up we have another black item in a large. Oh, did I order this twice? Yeah, oh, sorry guys, it looks like I've got this again. I'm sure I didn't. Yeah, how crazy is that? It looks like I ordered the same jumper twice. One in a 10 to 12, which was the first one, medium. And this one in a 12 to 14. So it looks like I've got this jumper again. Um, so <laughs> there you go, so that's that jumper again, Lisa, my sister, I'll send that to you so that you can wear it, um, there you go, you got yourself a black jumper, <laughs> just watch out for that when you're ordering. Right, last but not least is this one, um, I did, was umming and ahhing whether to buy this or not, but I'm kind of pleased that I did, even though I've not tried it on yet, because it's in this really snuggy, thick, material it feels like um sort of flannelette do you remember when you used to have flannelette sheets when we were kids um it feels like that but it's in this lovely sort of check pattern and it's got a paper bag waist as well it is a skirt and yeah it's by a company called thanners not sure of of where that's from 
but um, it looks, it's nice and elasticated around the waist. It, it's lovely for the winter, um, just to keep trendy as well, with thick black tights and boots, that would look amazing. Black, maybe roll neck, polo neck jumper, um, and that would look nice. Or you could just sort of pick out this sort of like red shade as well, but I absolutely love that. Um, again, it comes with the belt as well. Um, there is some hoop holes there just for um, to fasten that round, but I thought that was absolutely lovely as well. And again, that was a fiver too. So that's everything for the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you want to give me a big thumbs up, that would be brilliant. If you want to subscribe, you can do it in the link below. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and I'll leave it on the screen and I will see you all in the next video. Bye. Hello, how'd you do? I'm not broken, I'm just split in two. Hope you're fine. Ain't got time to do everything you said you would Frames of the past and the memory of you just come